Hi there guys, Bioinformatics guy here and welcome to another video of the series Machine Learning in Bioinformatics. In the last video we trained the models and then checked the accuracy of this, those models. Before moving on to making the predictions from those models, I would like to share a very important thing and that is saving and loading the models. Uh, so this training is done on a very small data. So when, whenever we train our models, it only takes a few seconds. But when you will start to train your models on huge data, so it is going to take a lot of time. So after training a model, it is always a good idea to save that model in our hard disk. So let's get started. In order to save the model, we will be using this library and its name is pickle. It's just like pickling in real life. So we will import pickle. So saving the model is very easy. Pickle dot dumb. Then we have to decide which model we have to save. Since logistic regression is giving us the highest accuracy, we will save that model and let's comment this out. Now we have to write down the name of our model, which is model. Then we open a file and the name of our file will be logistic regression dot model or we can only write M that will also be fine and we just also have to define that this is writable now that's all we have to do to save the model and when we want to load the model so let's name this model loaded model loaded model and uh, it is pickle dot load and then we have to open our file and our file name is logistic regression dot M and since we are going to only read this we will write RB let's run this no errors now let's comment this out and now we are going to print the accuracy by using our loaded model and now we are using loaded loaded model rather than using the model and let's see oh model is not defined oh oh we don't have to save our model again so let's comment this out again and run this great we got the 97 percent accuracy so that's all for this video and in the next video we will be making our predictions feel free to subscribe so that you don't miss my next video thank you very much for watching and i will see you around in my next video